Hey folks, Mr. Sheriff Thingabisi here. STEM Club co-sponsor and play versus esports coach at High Point High School in Prince George's County, Maryland. <coughs> million other things I do around here. Mamma mia! And welcome to the world of Mario Kart 8! Where you and your favorite Nintendo characters are in a knockdown drag out race to the finish. Each character is defined by five racing stats. Speed, acceleration, weight, handling, and traction. These stats are further modified by which vehicle, wheels, and glider you choose. Pay extra attention to speed, which determines your top speed. Handling, which determines how tight and responsive you tackle turns. And acceleration, which determines how quickly you reach your top speed and also affects your mini turbo boost. Each race in Mario Kart 8 actually starts before players get the green light. Right... Here! Start holding down your accelerate button when the two count stops moving or as soon as Lakito's second red light activates. Do this right and you'll get a rocket start, an early advantage in the competition. Turns are for another chance to boost your speed. Start turning and hold down R, the right shoulder button, to hop and begin a drift. Keep turning into the drift and colored sparks will appear under your vehicle's wheels. First blue, then orange, then purple or pink. When you release the R button and end the drift, you'll get a mini turbo, with higher color levels of mini turbo offering faster speed boost. In Mario Kart 8, aerial tricks are not just a way to look 20% cooler. Press the R button after launching off a ramp, jump, or cliff to trick off it and get a speed boost when you land. A core game mechanic of Mario Kart has always been items. And here, you can carry two at a time, using the order you collected them. Press L, the left shoulder button, to use your items. Some can be fired forward or backward, by pushing forward or backward when you press L. Some items can be carried behind you by holding L. This can help with other players or their items approaching from the rear. Denied. Normally, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe has 22 items. Some, like Koopa Shells, can hit other players, slowing them down. Some, like the Super Horn, can hit other players and their items. Some, like Mushrooms, can give you a speed boost. Some, like Coins, give you a lasting increase to your top speed. Others, like the Spiny Shell or Blue Shell, can mercilessly hunt down the player in first place. Oh, there's the finish line! I'm gonna win! I'm gonna win! <laughs> When you hit an item box, you have a higher chance of acquiring stronger items the farther you are from the player in first place. So become acquainted with what you and your opponents may employ. And this would not be a racing game without race tracks. As of the making of this video, the Booster Course Pass DLC brings the total number of available tracks to 96. Optimize your racing lines through the courses to lower your time. Keep an eye out for shortcuts, some of which benefit from speed boost items. Use the boost to get through! Memorize the tracks and practice, practice, practice to stay the leader of the pack and claim the checkered flag. This match is being scheduled through Playverses, one of the most prolific scholastic esports organizers in the United States and Canada. The match setup works like this. Each Mario Kart team is made up of four students. To begin, the teams face each other in a game for the match. Each game is divided into six races, all on randomized courses. Team-based races have some differences from individual-based races, such as homing attack items like the blue shell not deliberately targeting your team. New player launch detected. But team attack is on, 
Roger. Fire mission danger close. So he's coming! Get down! Get down! And the objective is still the same. Cooperating with your teammates to improve everyone's overall placement. At the end of each race, the students are awarded points. 10 points for first place, 8 points for second place, 6 for third, all the way down to 1 point for 8th place. The points are added up for each team, and whoever has more points at the end of 6 races wins the game. The match is best 2 out of 3 games, so whether the team that won Game 1's group of 6 races also wins Game 2, or the other team wins, and the students must square off in Game 3, it's... Congratulations! Let's go! Woohoo! And that's the basics of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe with Play Versus. Ladies and gentlemen, good luck, have fun, and Godspeed, because... Here we go! <laughs>